Welcome back to the Sanpon Saga. Let's get started. When we make something, it's important to have some fun, right? So today, let's just make some fun cellular automata. Let's use the cell pond engine to cast some magic spells. Toad? Bird? Can you help us out? Can you take it in turns to cast some spells? Toad, you can put your spells in these boxes. And Bird, you can put your spells in these. First up, Fire by Toad. You pick an orangey red fire colour and make some rules for rising, spreading and fading away. You drag hexagons onto each rule to change the chance of each one happening. The more filled in a hexagon is, the more likely it is that that rule happens. Flame by bird. That seems a little bit similar to fire, but okay. You pick a flamey colour and you make some rules. To increase the chance of a rule happening, just make more copies of the same rule. Nice try, bird, but it's not very original. And try to stay inside the lines next time. Lightning by Toad. Pick a colour for the tip of the lightning bolt and pick a colour for its trail. Make a rule for moving diagonally through the tip, the trail or the air. A small chance for changing direction or forking and a small chance for fading away. Tree by bird. Okay, bird, this looks more original. You make a rule for moving diagonally, a rule for changing direction, forking and fading. Wait a second, bird, this is just the lightning rules turned upside down. This looks new though. Pick a green leaf colour and make no rules. Just draw a picture. Sorry Toad, Bird took your box. Why don't you put it here? Fractal by Toad. Make a square of squares. Then right click and drag it off to make a self-referential room. I call this Cells in Cells in Cells. Super Fractal by Bird. Bird? You can't just write super in front of whatever Toad made. Okay, you combine different fractals together. You push them down even deeper. Watch out, Bird. You're making the engine run slow. You're making the screen glitch out. You're making the world crash. World by Toad. Any cell with some red inside reduces its red over time with a hexagon. And any time this happens, it splits into four. Click on the void to fill the screen with a single red cell. It splits and splits and splits again, leaving behind a world. World by Bird. Bird, we already made World. You didn't even write Super in front of it. Okay. You pick a blue sky colour. And you make any cell turn into quite a lot of them 
it takes quite a while, but in the end, it makes a world. I hope you enjoyed making some fun spells. Thank you very much for watching, and thanks to my patrons. Hopefully, I'll see you next time. Bird, what are you doing here? The video's over. You had some fun? You want to make some more? Toad, do you think we could make some more? Star by Toad. Make it shoot sideways, leaving behind a trail. The star and its trail both shimmer around and fade away. A beautiful flower by bird. Pick some lovely colours and draw a lovely picture. No rules needed. Pink sand by toad. Pick a pink colour. Make a rule for falling, a rule for sliding and flip it in both ways. Rainbow by Bird and Toad. Cells randomly copy themselves into empty spaces, changing the color of the copy a tiny bit each time. It produces some very colorful patterns. So let's do it again and again, and again. Rainbow by Toad and Bird. Fork the cell pond engine and give it a cool name. Use hue instead of red, green and blue. Then cast every spell again.